Hello people, welcome back. The question is from gate 2017 exam. This one is for two marks. Have a look at the statement. They are saying, consider the binary code that consists of four valid code words as given below. You can have a look at these four code words. Let the minimum hemming distance of the code be P and the maximum number of erroneous bits that can be corrected by the code be Q then the values of P and Q are, okay. So we need to find out the minimum hamming distance if these are the valid code words, okay. For finding out minimum hamming distance, we need to know the hamming distance between each and every pair. So let's find it out. So this is one pair, this is second pair and this is third pair. Let's first analyze these three pairs. So hamming distance between these two is 1, 2, 3. Okay. So this Hamming distance is 3. What is Hamming distance? The number of bits between two numbers that are different. See this bit is different, this bit is different, this bit is same and this bit is different. So it is 3. Now between these two numbers the Hamming distance will be 1, 2 and 3. This is also 3. Okay. This is 3 and between these two numbers it is 1, 2, 3 and 4. So here the Hamming distance is 4. Now keep in mind minimum Hamming distance till now is 3 because this is 3, 3 and 4 so minimum will be 3. Now let us analyze these pairs. Hamming distance between these two is 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay, so this Hamming distance will be 4. Let me just verify. 1, 2, 3, 4. Yeah, between these two it will be 1, 2, 3. So here minimum Hamming distance is again 3. Till now the minimum distance that we are getting is 3 only. Only one pair is left. That means these two numbers. Let's analyze them. It is 1, 2, and 3. Here also Hamming distance is 3. So overall minimum will be 3. That means value of P is equal to 3. Now we need to find out how many bit error can be corrected. Keep in mind we are talking about error correction. It is not error detection. It is error correction. Let me write the formulas. C. There are two formulas that can be used. I'll just write down both of them, then I'll explain it. So these are the two formulas that can be used. Let's just analyze both of them one by one. If you go by this formula, it says if minimum Hamming distance is equal to D, then you can correct maximum these many bits of error. Okay, let us find out. So value of D is 3. Minimum Hamming distance that we are getting is 3. So that means we can correct one bit error. Okay, so answer to this question is P is equal to 3 and Q is equal to 1. Okay, still let us just analyze this formula also once. They are saying to correct N bit error we need minimum Hamming distance is equal to 2n plus 1. We need to find out how many maximum bits can be corrected. So we need to determine the value of n. Now they are saying to correct n bit of error, we need MHD is equal to 2n plus 1. Minimum Hamming distance that we are getting is 3. That means 3 must be equal to 2n plus 1. So 3 is equal to 2n plus 1. That means 2n is equal to 2, so n is equal to 1. That means we can correct one bit error. Okay, so from here you can just see value of n is 1 and we can correct one bit errors. So the answer is still the same. Minimum Hamming distance is 3 and one bit errors can be corrected. It is not detected. We can detect more than one bit errors. Okay, 